Hi, I'm Bob Trump, physical therapist. Oof. Bob, Bob. I'm Brad Handy, physical therapist. And together we are the most famous physical therapists on the internet. In our opinion, of course. Brad, we just did a video on how to get up from a chair uh, using a walker, and now we're going to do a video on how to get up from a chair using a crutch. Right. And not only just how to get up, but how to get up safely so you don't fall. Um, these crutches are a little bit short for me, but the concept is uh, exactly the right. same. So uh, as you can see, no one's gonna, this would not work for me. Um, crutches are usually not used of people 70 and above, right. maybe in their 60s if they're pretty able, but this is for those people, uh, you know, watching this. In our 40 to 50 range, you might use yep. crutches. Yep. Especially if you have to do a lot of stairs. Yes, exactly. All right, so how do you manage these crutches when you're in a chair and you got, say, this leg is fractured and I cannot put any weight on it because it's uh, not ready for another four weeks. And you got these things and you, you got to try to figure out how you can get up. <laughs> Wait, Brad! Oh! Brad! I'm okay. Falling, but you can get up. Good. Pick up. All right. A lot of drama, Brad. I know. I like to be... You're kind of a stunt man. Well, yeah. Stunt or stud? Yeah, one of the two. <laughs> you decide. Okay, so if you have two crutches, because you need two if you're not weight bearing, seriously now, we're going to put them together like this, grab them with one hand so it becomes one crutch. Okay? I'm going to turn the chair this way. And then the palm of your heel right there is a very useful spot at this point. So I'm going to put it here, and I'm going to catch. The armrest right there. So ideally you want to be in a chair with an armrest. Yeah, you don't sit in chairs without armrests because yeah. it makes it a lot harder. If you, you know, no weight bearing and, and you need those crutches, then you scoop forward, nose over the toes. Common rules that therapists, all therapists know. And you push up here, I can maintain my non weight bearing. I got two crutches become one. I can balance here. Go like so. Bring this over to here. And we're up and running. Well, maybe hopping. Okay. So if you're in a chair without armrests, because I think you still can get up, right? Yeah, that's true. Much easier with armrests. And it depends on uh, the ability of the person as well. Right. I would probably turn and use the back. Sure. Push up from it. Why don't you go ahead, Brad? Okay. If you do sit down and you say, darn, I sat down with our armrests, fear not. Because Bob and Brad are here too. That's right. <laughs> to save the day. To save the day. Get your computer out and Google us. All right. So here we're going to turn this way. Again, keep the crutches together. Keep them together. Yeah. Yeah. And then here, and that works pretty good. And you get up, over, back. Now sitting down, whether you got armrest or not. Again, same thing. Put those crutches together. Lock them up and reach down here, get that leg out, and simply sit down, take your crutches, set them up here. Can I show another alternative, Brad? I mean, you better move this way too, of course, where you can just go both hands like this and, and push up like this. Yeah. And then get them together like this. And again, depending on your skill level or skill set, you didn't think they fit you. They really don't fit me. <laughs> so. Yeah, ideally, pick, pick a chair without arms. It's going to help make things a lot easier. Right. And, right. and uh, avoid the uh, couches where you're really going to sink in because you're really going to be lower. Yeah. It'd be better to leave it on the chair. Um, we do have a video on how to negotiate steps with crutches. Yeah. Um, and how to adjust them for the proper height. If you have those questions, uh, just Google, uh, you know, our names and put those subjects in, and you'll pull up a video on that. So sounds good. There's really not much that we cannot help these people with, except for uh, well, we can't fix that broken heart, Brad. We just can't. We're working on it, though. 